क्लिक द बेल आइकन टू गेट लेटेस्ट वीडियोस फ्रॉम ईकीडा हेलो फ्रेंड्स नाउ वी आर गोइंग टू सॉल्व द प्रॉब्लम्स बेस्ड ऑन रिग्रेशन नाउ वी हैड डन अर्लियर अ पार्ट कॉल्ड एज फोरकास्टिंग दिस कैन बी कॉल्ड एज अ कंटिन्यूएशन ऑफ द सेम टॉपिक वेयर वी आर सॉल्विंग सम एडिशनल प्रॉब्लम्स व्हिच मे बी आस इन द एग्जाम फॉर मिनिमम 4 मार्क्स टू मैक्सिमम 6 मार्क्स डोंट एक्सपेक्ट अ प्रॉब्लम ऑफ मोर देन 6 मार्क्स इन द एग्जाम based on forecasting or based on regression and correlation let's read the problem and try to understand the whole concept problem 13 five children age 2 3 5 7 and 8 five bachcho ka humko age diya gaya hai वेट 14, 20, 32, 42 एंड 44 केजी और उनका वेट भी दे दिया है सो इट इज नोट डाउन द एज एंड द वेट्स वर्टिकली सो ये एज और ये वेट टू थ्री फाइव सेवन एंड एट इज द एज और वेट है आपका इनका 14 आप एज को वाई लेके वेट को भी एक्स ले सकते हो कोई दिक्कत नहीं है बट आई प्रिफर टू टेक द फर्स्ट एज वेरिएबल एज एक्स And the second variable as y. I'll just note down the assumption here. Let x denotes age of the children, and let y denotes weight. of the children so we are just noted down let's see the problem i had again one of the problem will i find the equation of the regression line of age age matlab x on weight weight matlab y so we have to find out the regression line x on y and second based on this data what is the appropriate weight that is find the value of y of a 6 year old child the first case mein maine bola find out the regression equation of age on weight matlab x on y so humko pehla nikalna hai regression equation x on y what is the formula for this regression equation for regression equation we will first find out the regression coefficient bxy आपका रिग्रेशन कोइफिशियंट बी एक्स वाई का फॉर्मूला आएगा एन इंटू समेशन एक्स वाई माइनस समेशन एक्स इंटू समेशन वाई अपॉन एन इंटू समेशन वाई स्क्वायर माइनस समेशन वाई द होल स्क्वायर ये हमारा बेसिक फॉर्मूला है रिग्रेशन का अब मुझे क्या क्या वैल्यू चाहिए मुझे चाहिए समेशन एक्स वाई तो आई जस्ट मल्टीप्लाई एक्स इन टू वाई आई नीड वाई स्क्वायर तो आई जस्ट टू वाई स्क्वायर नो नीड ऑफ डूइंग एक्स स्क्वायर हियर तो फर्स्ट आई मल्टीप्लाई एक्स इन टू वाई तो टू इंटू फोर्टीन इट विल बी ट्वेंटी एट थ्री इंटू ट्वेंटी इट विल बी सिक्सटी फाइव इंटू थर्टी टू इट विल बी वन सिक्सटी सेवन इंटू फोर्टी टू इट विल बी टू नाइन्टी फोर लास्ट इट विल बी एट इंटू फोर्टी फोर विच इज 320 plus 32, 352. So we are done with the first part, the totals. Now we'll do the totals of x y. It is 28 plus 60 plus 160 plus 294 plus 352, which comes to 894. And this is 14. And twenty, thirty-four, thirty-four, thirty-six, sixty-six, sixty-eight, one zero eight, one one two, and one fifty-two. This is two, five, ten, seventeen, and eight. 
25. So we are done with the x, y, x, y and we will now do y square. y square is 14 square, 196, 20 square is 400. 32 square will be I think 964, I'll just verify 1024 from the calculator. Next is 42 square is, 42 into 42 will be 1764. Next is 44 square, which is 1936. So 1936 plus 1764 plus 1024 plus 400 plus 196 so this comes to 5320 now the second part i will find out the regression coefficient first let's put a table here this is summation x this is summation y summation xy and summation y square the next part um, we will put out the values in the formula so i will get b of x y equals to n is number of observations there are five observations will be 5 into summation x y ka total aega 894 minus summation x into summation y will be 25 into 152 divide by niche aega 5 into Summation y square is 5320. See, summation y square may have y square ka total dalo or summation y bracket square may summation y ka total 152. So, here 152 ka square dal do. So, try to get the point very clear. Many other times students do the whole sum correctly and but then they put up the wrong values and they get the wrong answers and then blame the professors that they are not going to give the marks. It will be 5 into 894, which comes to 4470. Minus 25 into 152, 3800. Divide by 5320 into 5, 53, 5320 into 5, it is 26600 minus 152 multiplied by 152, it comes to 23104. So this will be 3496 niche aega. Put 4470 minus 3800 which comes to 670 divided by 3496 which comes to 0 0.1916. I can write as 0 0.19. So this is my regression coefficient x on y. Now I will do the second part on the next page. I will calculate first x bar and y bar. For x bar the formula is summation x upon n. For y bar the formula is summation y upon n. In the present case, it is x cut total 25, y cut total 152. So x is 25 divided by 5. This is 152 divided by 5. So, first case may I go, so it will be 5. Second case may I go, 152 divided by 5 will be 30.4. The last part, regression equation x on y. Why x on y? Because they have asked us to calculate or to find out the regression equation of age on the weight. So I will write the formula x minus x bar equals to bxy bracket y minus y bar. Which is x minus my x bar is 5. bxy is how much? My bxy was 0 0.19. And y minus my y bar is 30.4. So, x minus 5 equals to 0 0.19 y minus 0 0.19 into 0.19 into 30.4. So, it will be 
so x will be 0 0.19 y minus 5 will be minus 5.776 will be minus 5 यहाँ पे आएगा तो plus हो जाएगा okay in this case it will be x equals to 0 0.19 y minus 0 0.7 Seven six. So this is my standard equation. Now what they ask us in the problem? The last part. Based on this data, what is the approximate approximate weight? So they ask us to find out the weight that is y of a six year old child. Six year is the age that is x. So they ask us to find out the approximate weight that is y of a six year old. There is age. So we are, we need to find out the uh, what do you say uh, the regression line y on x rather than x on y for this b part. So we'll do the b part on the next page. For b part, I will find out first regression coefficient y on x that is b y x. Formula will be n into summation x y minus summation x into summation y upon n into summation x square minus summation x the whole square. So n is how much or number of years. So this was my original table. Uh, my n is number of years. The number of observations were five. I will just put it to 5 here, 5 multiplied by summation xy, xy got 894, minus summation x got 25, summation y is 152, 25 into divided by n is again 5, multiplied by summation x square now i don't i don't know summation x square to be very honest apne paas is table mein kahin par bhi summation x square nahi hai to humko nikalna padega hame yahan pe summation x square nikalna hai for the second part because we have already made one table to hum isi part mein wo nikal lenge it will be 2 square 3 square 5 square 7 square and 8 square. I will add these numbers. It will be 4 plus 9, 13. 13 plus 25 plus 49 plus 64. It is 151. This will be called as summation x square. So let's use these numbers now. X minus 25, Y 152, summation X square 151. I'll use 151 here minus summation X the whole square. After summation X the 25 the whole square. I'll solve this part first. 894 into 5 is 4470. Minus 25 into 152. 3800 next is 25 5 into 151 755 next 25 square is 625 so 755 minus 625 will be 130 for like a 4470 minus 38 38 double zero this comes to 670 divided by 130 will be 5.1538 this can be round off and as 5.154 so now we are done with the uh, regression coefficient y on x now we will find out the regression line y on x so regression line y on x is 
y minus y bar equals to x minus x bar और ये जो regulation और equation b y x यहाँ पे अपना formula आएगा तो इटली y minus मेरा y bar था my y bar was five we are doing it earlier मेरा b y x है five point one five four x minus x bar ka value hai my x bar is so my x bar is 5 my y bar is 30.4 so my x bar is 5 I'll just make a minor correction here my y bar is so it will be y minus my y bar is 30.4 we will simply solve this part and we will get the equation so I just saw here besides the same page it will be y equals to 5.14 x minus 5.154 multiplied by 5 give you 25.77 so it will be y minus 30.4 equals to 5.154 x minus 25.77 y will be equal to 5.14 x minus 25.77 और ये plus हो जाएगा minus 30.4 minus 30.4 so it will be plus 4.63 so this was the second part now they are asked us to calculate the weight when age is six years what is the approximate weight of a six year old child so lehenge based on the study we can calculate weight we y equals to 5.14 x minus sorry plus 4.63 so y will be equal to our age that is x is equal to 6 years it will be 5.154 into 6 plus 4.63 5.154 into 6 plus 4.63 so y will be 35.554 approximately therefore expected weight equals to 36 kg to be approximate thanks thanks for watching this video do subscribe to our channel ikida